we take a look at 5 levitating gadgets which you can actually buy. Starting at number 5, the OVR Charge. This new wireless magnetic charger is pretty cool, although it's a bit overpriced for being a simple levitation device. It charges through induction and it floats by electromagnetism. It's fairly balanced, but one drawback is that your phone does need a special case, which is included with the product. Now, it does work with most phones, including Apple and Samsung phones, and the company even claims that it has a universal attachment for phones that do not fit in the case. But I have a feeling that many competitors will try to mimic this device and sell a cheaper levitating charger. At number 4, the life. Your plants can finally come to life and exist in permanent suspension. The Life is a planter box which hovers over an oak base through magnetic levitation. It constantly rotates so it can give your plant full sunlight exposure. Now the company claims that this will really benefit our plants. And there are some theories that magnetic fields will actually help ripen certain fruits. But I guess in time we will find out if that theory really holds true. Now the unit only uses about 3 watts of power which is very little but it does start at around $200 so it's kind of expensive for a planter box. Uh, number 3, the Levitating Nixie Clock. The first levitating clock of its kind is definitely a marvel of design and creativity. It's a fusion between electromagnets and air transformers, and the whole thing can be controlled via Bluetooth. Time data is relayed through infrared sensors and it has a wireless power coil, so the thing will literally run forever. And yes, it does have a backup battery which lasts for 30 hours in case the power goes out. Now there's only two models available which is the Relay, which is shown here, and a smaller version called the Beacon. It's a really cool idea, even though it's just a bit pricey for a clock. And I can almost guarantee you that more levitating clocks will be on the market probably very soon. So there are a few good levitating speakers on the market right now, including the Sansonic X2, the Ice Orb which has built in LED lighting, and my personal favorite, the Music Angel. Now all three of these speakers have generally good reviews and have decent sound for levitating speakers. But I also want to point out that it will definitely not replace some of the better non-levitating standing speakers in similar price ranges. So just keep in mind that the levitating thing is a little bit of a gimmick. So finally we get to the next position and it's also making weather with its realistic design. The cloud duels as a Bluetooth speaker and it's an artificial storm. And its built-in LEDs react to the beats of the music being played. But let's just hope it does not zap the user. Now the company has already built similar cloud products which cost over $3,000. So this making weather product will likely be very expensive once it comes out. At number 1, the Maglev Audio Turntable. The first levitating turntable has turned a lot of heads when it was unveiled. The platter which holds the record being played also levitates and rotates. Now the device can switch between 45 and 35 RPM, so it can play most records and it has a built-in safe system which can automatically stabilize the platter in a power outage. Now if you're old like me and you kinda like the vintage stuff, then you finally have a reason to go get those old records in the attic. Now the Maglev is pretty expensive as starting prices are around $800 on their Kickstarter campaign, but this will also likely increase quite a bit as there's already been a lot of interest in the product. So this video covers some of the more unique products, but there are plenty of levitating gadgets coming out all the time. But if you like this kind of stuff, then make sure you check out my 5 Real Hoverboards video. So once again, thanks for watching, please like the video and subscribe to my channel.